Developing now a gun battle at a North Philadelphia gas station left a security guard injured and another man dead. Action News worked overnight to obtain this store surveillance that captured the confrontation. Reporter Catherine Skye is live at police headquarters with that new frightening video, plus new leads on who may have been involved. Good morning, Catherine. Good morning, Matt. And yes, we'll show you that video in just a moment. This all remains under invest investigation as a security guard is recovering at the hospital and one man has died. We paused the video, but you could hear the gunfire in this surveillance footage in North Philadelphia last night. This happened at the Phillips 66 around 7 p.m. on West College Avenue by Poplar. In the video, you can see a 39 year old man walk into the store. The 30 year old private security guard tells him to leave and pushes him back. The man grabs a gun from his waistband. They exchange a few heated words, then the shooting starts. The security company said the guard is a father of three, including a newborn, and said he feared for his safety and the safety of others in the store. You can see police at the gas station last night collecting evidence, including multiple guns. A security guard who was licensed to carry was shot in the leg in his stable. The other man was shot in the face and legs and pronounced dead at the hospital. A stray bullet hit a nearby home, but no one inside was injured. Police believe he could be the owner of a nearby food truck and would come to the mini mart often. Overnight, we found social media video depicting who appears to be the same man on the surveillance video, and that's an angle homicide detectives are currently pursuing. We did recover a weapon from the individual that was shot and killed that's still on the scene outside and we have at least one weapon possibly two inside of the property which we believe were in possession of the security guard. The name of the man who died has not been released by police. We're live at police headquarters. Catherine Scott, Channel 6 Action News. All right, Catherine, thank you.